Alison wants to find out how much time people spend reading books. She's going to use a questionnaire, design a suitable question for Alison to use in her questionnaire. It's worth two marks, so we're going to get one mark at least for the question and possibly one for some answer boxes. So, kind of question was going to definitely have to say uh, something quite simple, you know. How long do you usually spend reading books. Now at the moment it's not going to get me any marks because I'm not given a time frame. If you don't give a time frame for questions like this people are not going to know what they mean. It could be every year, every day. So I'm going to say every day. It really doesn't matter. Nothing has been specified in the problem. So it doesn't matter what time frame you use. There, that's probably going to give me one mark. Second mark always comes from answer boxes. Yeah, usually just at least three. Now be very careful with the way that you do these. You don't want to have anything overlapping. You want to have some reasonable results without any big gaps in it. So I might give a, a nice small value, not to two hours. Between two and six hours and over six hours. Not great that I've made the gaps between the times different, but I have included all times. There is no overlap. You could say there's potential overlap between here, but I've said between two and six, that implies bigger than two hours. So that would get me two marks.